Mm. I started school in Taita after mm. that. In 1968, yeah. I came to Mombasa. My father was working in Mombasa in KPA. Okay. So I came there, I started, I started school in Mombasa up to Form 4. Mm-hmm. After I finished that, I came in Nairobi. I was in Yami. I was in Yami. So I could learn me on. It we'll talk about that a little later. Let's talk about um, your music uh, as a teenager uh, mm-hmm. when you joined uh, the Mombasa International Band. How did that come about? Oh, that band, Mombasa International, it's our band. We are, we are eight school, school boys, mm-hmm. eight. So from there, uh, I left Mombasa internationally. Then I came in Nairobi. Mm-hmm. I started working with the Leswanyika. Leswanyika. But first when you came to Nairobi, you, you joined the Air Force as an artist, right? Yes, after, yeah, after that, yeah. I joined Leswanyika. 1983. Okay. Yes. That, so... First was Simba Wanyika and then came uh, the Les Wanyika. First Simba Wanyika, after Simba Wanyika, yeah. I left Simba Wanyika, I yeah. left Les Wanyika. So, Wanyika, you were led by the late uh, Wilson, Peter Kinyonga and, and his George brother, Peter, George, George, Peter. Peter, yeah. George Peter Kinyonga yeah. in 1983. Yeah. How was that experience with the Simba Wanyika band? It was good, but uh, I left there mm-hmm. because I, went, I wanted to be, you know, eh, to become a good musician. Right. So that's why Professor Wari took me. Very so then you joined Les Wanyika, yeah, led by the late John Gereza and right? Professor Murray. And yes, of course, yeah. And uh, you were you, you were involved in the song Lipi La Ajab, Lipi La Ajab, yes, mm. yeah. Uh, can you give us a light from the song? It's a long time, it's a long time ago, but, but I'll try. Lipi La Ajab, when you need to go zangu. Niki pata tabu, bona muna o narae. I forgot it. It's a long time. It's been a long, long time. A long ago, time. Long time. Yes. Yeah, long time. Yeah. All right. Let's let's talk about that very famous track, Stella. Okay. Tell us the story, and you can express yourself in Swahili. Tell us more about it. Okay, Stella. She was my girlfriend. I go and saw me and I saw my shule. So to October, I was at Leswanyika. At that time, I was with Leswanyika Bombas Club. So I was with Auntie Yake, Apu Kenya Science Teacher oh. Training College. Okay. So that's where I met her. Mm-hmm. To call my friend, to call my friend. I went to university in Nairobi, and then I got to go to Japan. But to call her, to go to Japan, I got to go to Japan. Japan, you know. So after that, we got to go you were heartbroken. Yes. But you did everything for her. Yes. You even sold your car. It is a true story. Yes. Pigot 504. <laughs> KAG 126. And you stayed in touch right through her career in Japan? You were in constant contact with her? Yeah, we was, but nowadays, she, she's an oil of somebody. So. Yeah, no, at that time, when yeah. she was studying, you yeah. were still in contact with her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you got a shock when she arrived at the airport. Huh? Yes. With a child in her hand and her Japanese and husband. And Japan, short man. So that was the shock. Yeah. And that's what inspired you with Stella, which became a very, very big hit. Yes. Now, why don't you sing uh, Stella for us? Right a cappella, now. right now. Nilikuwa na mshumba wangu tulipenda na kama nyama chomo alibatika kwenda nyambo chuo kikuu kwenda kusoma miaka mitatu kule Japan kusomea udakitari sela wangu ndivyo mpenda stela jaman kajitolea kwa roho moja nikauza shamba langu sababu yake yeye Nika uza gari langu sababu yake yeye Nika uza ngombe na mbuzi sababu yake yeye ili apate nauli ande na pesa nyingine za matumizi huko Japan Excellent
That was in uh, 1991 when you first recorded it. You 92, 92, 92, 92. 92. Yes, record, 92. So it came, it came a hit 93. 93. Yeah. Alafu remix. 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 This one remix. Yeah. See, last year. Last year. Last year, November. Yeah. Yeah. That was also, once again, a very big hit. Yeah. <laughs> now, you've also done a track. We commend you for that song, which was an amazing track. And the remix was also really good, which you gave a reggae feel to that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. A reggae touch. Yeah. Now, we ask you, uh, rather, you've also done a track to one of the victims of uh, Ntogwe Ferry Disaster. Uh, tell us the story, and maybe you can give us a verse uh, from the song. Okay, Mtungo Ferry, that song, Nili Tunga Wimbo Huo, Wakatu Huo, Ilikuwa Nisirikali, Ilikuwa Moi. Na Ilikuwa Nipatika Na Ajali, Ya Mtungo Ferry, Ile Ferry Lipenduka, Na Watu Ndani Yake. So, Nilipo Imba Mimi, Ikachukulua Kisiasa. So, Ikabaniwa Huo Mbo, Uka Huko, Tena Paka Saivi. So, Wata Mimi, Kama Mimi Usawa, Kwa Sabu Libaniwa, Ile Shukulua Kama Siasa, Nona, Ukabaniwa. Kwa Sabu Kama Mimi, Litia Shumvi, Kwa Ile Accident. So, so that was you. actually banned. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. Mm. And but now, I'm sure it can still it can be played now. Now that Mo is no longer there, <laughs> I think uh, no, there is no need because they have so many songs. Yes, yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. No so many other tracks. Yeah, yeah. 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 Now you're, you're still doing new projects. Uh, we have uh, two tracks. One is Jirani Wacha Ubaya. Yes. Uh, what's this song about? And give us a verse and. Uh, Another one is Wakesho. Mm -hmm. Tell us about it and give us a verse of that as well. Okay, Wakesho, I made the video last week. So mm -hmm. next week, it will cost a coin. Here, Wakesho. Wakesho, history of it, I was a musician who was a musician who was a musician. I was a musician who was a musician who was a musician. I was a musician who 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 was a so <laughs> 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 Vachiruna vacho kwa na vasero Vibandilo nisa kusawa kesho wapo Yiriri changa, yiriri changa Nalia wa kesho wa wasipse kensige Mwendo wa kesho, duka ndige mwendo wa kwa Penzi wa kesho, sindi wa chendi teseke That's the record Very nice, very nice And the other one? Hey, Majer Kula na nasi shibi jamani ye na uga sitakati Uyo uyo jirani yangu ho ananikafako Ananiandea kwa waganga ye jina langu lipote Na uliza jirani ye nimekosa nini Unaniandea kwa waganga ye jina langu lipote Na uliza kwa nini nimekosa nini Na uliza kwa nini ye nimekosa nini ye very nice. Lovely. You need a round of applause for that as well. And I think they sound very catchy tunes. Yeah. And like you said, Bakesho is already very, very popular right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, how do you compose your tunes? How are you inspired? Is it all about ex girlfriends and new girlfriends or girlfriends that have left you? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Mimi, who are a Tunga Yimbo. Yeah. Kuangale vitu weni, vile ujua mimi nyimbo zangu nyingi, nyimbo zangu nyingi ni nyimbo ambazo kuwa za mafundisho, mm -hmm. messages. Mamba na otokea, na yale ya lofanyika, mm -hmm. na yale ambayo na otokea. Yani mimi mizikiangu mimi ni kufundisha watu. Wana? Ni kufundisha watu. 
ndio kipaji lipo na Mwenyezi Mungu so mimi siimbagi nyimbo hivi hivi hata kama ni nyimbo ya mapenzi iko na maana fulani kwa hey. example like Stella kwa kwa example like Stella any lessons of life sijui yeah. <laughs> Stella inakuambia eh? right now ukipata mchumba wako mm. fulani mm-hmm. si lazima waenda Japan kama wangu ukienda <laughs> Ulaya tu yeah. but you will think oh atanifanya kama fresh lady you know yeah. you see so mimi nyimbo zangu hata kama nyimbo ya mapenzi yeah. lazima inakuwa na maana fulani ya mafundisho sasa kimba timpenzi na kupenda hivi sipoko na sasa kulala hiyo si vitu kama hivyo yeah. naimba vitu na maana fulani yeah na hiyo usia nilipata kwa professor Omar lesonyika ndio nilipa mpigo huo utakimba nyimbo huyu mzuri angalia vitu ambavyo vya kuelimisha watu si mbi nyimbo hivi hivi nyimbo zangu zote kufuatilia ni nyimbo ziko na mawaidha yeah na zitadumu namna hiyo ni message a message, yeah, message for people across yeah, the yeah, board yeah. for everyone yeah yeah Um, have you ever done an english song or any intention to do an english song nafikiria kufanya nafikiria kufanya kuna moja nafikiria kufanya kuna moja nafikiria kufanya tumeni kuanzia mwezi wa 5 kuanzia mwezi wa 5 nitakuwa naweza kufanya hiyo and the mix of uh, swahili and taita swahili and, and taita and kizungu mm-hmm. and the other uh, other languages in kenya Yeah, you know the fire a good mix yeah 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 yeah, yeah. 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 combination ya taita swahili na yeah, english yes yes <laughs> with a reggae feel to it yeah yeah freshly mamburi yes a new combination uh, very successful career your message for upcoming artists okay so for a veteran like you a so great like, musician uko na swali nzuri sana nitajibu hivi Mm. Music ni kazi. Sio stare. Mm. Lakini wengi pengine kama vijana wenzetu wanafanya vizuri lakini wengine wanachukulia kama stare. Mm-hmm. Music ni kazi. Na music ni mawaidha yeah. na message. Kwanza utunge nyimbo. Mu- music, music ni serious business. Yes, it's it? a business. Yes. It's serious. a business ni kazi. And you have to be serious about it. Yeah. It's not so, fun. Yeah. Sasa unapotunga nyimbo hiyo lazima unatunga nyimbo ukijua watu wat appreciate. Mm-hmm. Unaongea juu ya nini? Ukisema unataka kutunga nyimbo kuzungumzia bara simu hii, zungumzia bara simu watu waelewe unasema nini. Unasikia? Sasa kuna wengine music ya vijana wanafanya vizuri. Unasikia? Kwa vijana wanafanya vizuri music yao simba. Tena sikizo kuna race fulani wanakuwa na kwa computer wanatengenezwa beats. Unaona? Mm-hmm. Sio kama sisi mimi kitakurekodi naingia kwa studio na wana muziki wangu na viombo. Wao ni tofauti wanatengenezwa beat anaika tu maneno unasikia lakini yale maana unaotumia nyimbo inatoka leo inamaliza tu about two two months later yeah. kwa sababu haina message so nige ningeweza kuomba nyimbo zao wanazotunga wao wanaweka ni message yeah. ambayo itaweza kuwasaidia na kuendeleza mbele kwa sababu unaweza kuona kama hao vijana anaweza kuwa ana nyimbo kama kwa mwaka mmoja ana nyimbo 30 na zote zote dead stock you see dead stock kwa sababu yeah, kwa sababu hazina mawaidha they don't even go to studios yeah. sitting at home yeah kwa computer kwa computer alafu anaweka tu maneno finished yeah. na ile maneno anaweka ni maneno ambayo hayana maana mpenzi na kupenda sipo kuona sasa kulala kwa hiyo unaweza kukosa mpenzi kumwona ulala uko sio unasingizi hiyo uwezekani mm. nisipo kuona mimi sisi kula chakula unaweza kuona sikia chakula sikula chakula sasa mpenzi no hiyo uwezekani hiyo <laughs> uwezekani mm. so naomba hivi siko maana ila takesh sikia maneno yangu yatamsaidia naomba hivi unapotunga nyimbo kwanza siku hizi mambo mengi yametoka kwa vijana. Vijana wanaharibika sana. Kuna madawa kuleva, kuna mambo mengi. Unaweza kuyatumia kuelimishana wao wenyewe kwa wenyewe, kwa wenyewe. Lakini na kama ni nyimbo ya mapenzi ukitoka lakini iwe na maana fulani. Sio mpenzi na kupenda tu, mpenzi na kupenda tu. Hiyo mambo ilianza zamani, eh? Na unafundisha nani mapenzi? Hata mnyama anajua mapenzi. Eh? Yeah. Now, tell me about recording artists and performing artists, you know? The difference between the two when you're recording artists and you have one who is a real performer as well now we have a lot of people performing on stage and are getting very popular what's the difference between the two if you if you understand what i'm trying to say nikoelewa hapo kuna tofauti kubwa kwa sababu yule 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 ale perform kwa stage ni kazi anafanya na pengine ana perform kwa stage na ni nyimbo ya mtu sio nyimbo yake Mm-hmm. Umeelewa? Mm-hmm. Anaimba nyimbo ya mtu. Anaimba nyimbo fresh lay. Mm-hmm. Kwa fundu Stella. Yeah. Si nyimbo yake. Sasa ana perform ile ni kazi. Eh, ni kazi tu anapata yeah. risk, yes. you know? Lakini so mtu muhimu ndio ambaye anarecord. 
ndio ndio muhimu kabisa kwa sababu wana wana perform wengine wanacheza nyimbo za watu yes. tukuta ni band lakini anacheza nyimbo za copyright yeah. sasa hiyo 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 ina maana mm-hmm. eh nikurudisha tu watu na nyimbo za watu lakini mtu wa maana kabisa ni yule composer mwenyewe yeah, yeah. A recording artist a composer yeah composer takes a lot of time yes uh, recording artists who put so much effort yeah. and when you go out to perform mm. is the public appreciating you sana sana they are sana sana yes which is good to hear yeah and i like that yeah nikiona kucheza mali wananipokea atuseme kama hii christmas yote nimekuwa Mombasa nimeenda Meru nimepokea kama president you know paka nimekuwa board guards you know people love you Yeah, I was be carrying like this yeah. <laughs> like a baby. And you enjoy yes. do you enjoy performing live? Yeah. 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 You know? And your hit song must be what? Stella? Yeah, Stella, yeah. Everybody Stella, 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 everybody Stella, Stella. In the town when I work in town, oh that guy Bumburi Stella, 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 you know? <laughs> Where is Stella today? Still in Kenya? Oh, she's in Japan. She's in Japan. And today, leo ni mwana katika katika mtandao. Yeah. Amejibu. Uh amejibu lakini sio yeye imetokea tu ni mwanamke ile msiyo kama kwa kwa simu yako kuna iko kwa simu yako lazima iko iko katika online Stella Flora na imba hapo ndani ananijibu mimi okay lakini but in the friend yake Stella aha sasa Stella mwenyewe bale wao just Stella sio musician she's a doctor okay but that woman ni rafiki yake mhm na she's a musician okay so I'm convinced kumtuma aweze kunijibu kwamba hana makosa alikuwa ananipenda alishua kwenye ndege akiwa na mtoto wa jirani mwingine mjapani so mimi nikashukuria kwa makosa nika drive gari yangu mbio karibu nipigwe watu yani mambo mengi it is your right you know lakini sasa ikiwa naweza kusema tu kama Stella anataka kurudi kwangu mimi nimeshaoa lakini kama anataka pale mwisho nilimba i still love you pale mwisho i still love you come back come back Stella so kama anataka kuja ndio sijakataa lakini kuna conditions oh You still ready to accept her back eh? with with conditions. <laughs> yeah. But you know now since since tuliachana na yeye okay niko na mwingine nimeoa na mama watoto niko na watoto. Sasa yule ndio namba 1 sasa. Right. Yule ndio mwenyekiti. Ndio chair lady sasa. Yeah. Sasa kama anaweza kutaka kurudi itakuwa ni condition pia nitafikiria na kama atarudi basi itabidi awe namba 2. <laughs> kama atapenda. <laughs> okay we we'll leave it at that. It's been great speaking to you. Thank you. <laughs> Freshly yes you've had a fantastic career Freshly Mwamburi Asante sana Asante thank you it's been extreme pleasure speaking to Freshly Mwamburi who has given us the iconic song Stella Wangu in 1992 and it was remastered with a reggae feel in 2021 he has been part of a boy band in Mombasa Simba Wanyika and Les Wanyika and has been part of the greatest compositions in Kenya and he has a new track like rather two tracks Jirani Wacha Obaya and Wakesho. Thank you Freshly Wamburi. We wait for the next 17th of May to have Stella on high rotation. Thank you for watching. I am Fayaz Qureshi.